Okay, I have a question from a viewer about the triangle inequality property. And what I've done with this is just try to break it down in the simplest terms. That way it makes sense for uh, the viewers. And the triangle inequality property basically says that the sum of the lengths of any two sides must be greater than the third side. Now, we know a triangle has three sides. There's, that's where tri comes from within the word triangle. It has three sides. And what I've done is I've drawn a triangle here versus a triangle here. Now, the triangles look the same. I mean, relatively the same. Um, but I've thrown numbers up there and one that makes sense for the triangle inequality property and one that violates it. Here we have a length of four, a length of six, and a length of five. If you take any two sides and add them together, they'll all exceed the length of the third side. So for example, four plus five is nine, nine is greater than six. Six plus five is 11, 11 is greater than four. Four plus six is 10, 10 is greater than five. You can see how that works. This um, works with a triangle inequality property. This is an example here. This over here is not. If you just pay attention to the numbers representing the side lengths, two, seven, and four, we can clearly see two plus four is six, and 6 is not greater than 7. Therefore, this triangle with those measures violates the triangle inequality property. And that's really all there is to the triangle inequality property. I hope this makes sense. And uh, thanks for checking this video out.